Ayan, shazada here. So, if you want to get the, um, you know, the new uh, Xbox built on your machine, you can get it. So, to access it, the process is quite simple. So, first of all, you need to go to settings. Um, there's one thing, though, I would advise. If you are upgrading it, and it's some, because it's a, you know, beta version, it, it's a test build. So, it's not fully ready yet, So or like a preview version. So, if it breaks you will most likely will need to reset your windows uh, to start everything from scratch. I have set up like a, a restore point. I am not sure if it will, like if something breaks, I can revert to that or will I need to complete install. From what I've seen, you might have to re, uh, reinstall the windows, but I'm not sure. I haven't seen anybody talking about that if they have set up a restore point before that and they were able to restore it back. So to get it, it's quite straightforward. You need to go to Windows Update. From here, you will see Windows Insider program. Come here. Now, you need to do is like, it will gi give you option to get started, right? Then it will ask you to link your account. When you link that here, it will like you see like how, how it says like Windows, Center, uh, Windows um, Insider account. It gives you the option to like uh, choose the insider settings. So you can use the dev channel and from there, you can sort of get the build you need. So you will be getting, uh, like you need to accept the terms. When you accept those ones, it will ask you to restart, restart. When you come back on, uh, first thing is when you do sort of like a update, it will, it might give you like some of the updates to complete. When all the updates are like checked, it might not show up again. So check it like a couple of times, make sure like mine got listed second time. So uh, do the one uh, update, make sure everything is ready. You can check it again. If it doesn't pop up, try restarting again. And then most likely it will pump, give you the prompt to for the insider build. When you do that, uh, it will get listed. Then uh, you can is like you restart your device and then you can check it. Um, it will, and when you go to settings, later on and what you can do is if you go to gaming tab here it will give you like another prompt and you can like what will happen is it will give you the option to choose the home screen app there you will be using the xbox and then it will start up that experience though you will need to set up like a one shortcut key to launch your uh armor crate because it is not loading by default so you do need to set up that for your build as it is a test build so be mindful of that on the rogueallylife.com there is an option if you are not getting that so you can sort of force it through on your device and force install it uh, so i'll put the link for that and as you can see now mine is just installing so it's gonna take some time i will create a video on how to like how it looks how it Im impacts and you will see like a bit of performance notice because the main difference will be is like now look at this one. So if you go to task manager and go to here, you have almost like 100 tasks running, right? So which is using close to 68% of my uh, RAM. Reason being, I have almost dedicated 8 gigs to the uh, my GPU so you can it depends because some titles they do need at least six to eight gigs of RAM otherwise they will have issues so or you can leave it at auto that depends on you so on what games you're playing so it gives you a bit more flexibility but like as you can see like mainly it's like it's over like 100 now and there is as you can see there's there's not even much open from the my perspective okay there is like one launcher two launcher three launchers that's that's it then when the source manager your settings and normal create so that's the one which is like have some sort of interaction the rest of it is like windows so that build will cut off a lot of like sort of noise which is running and you're not even doing anything so i'll create a video how how it is and so if you are having issues if you're not able to get that follow the rogue um, ally life and then they should be able to get that version that's pretty much it. If you have any questions, do let me know. Take care. Have a good day. Bye.